Hello ladies, welcome back to my channel. So today's topic is going to be about why I don't encourage you ladies to sit next to customers for more than a certain period of time. And I just want to talk about this for a little bit um, because I think um, some women just don't understand why this is or why they shouldn't do it. And first of all, you know, these guys come into the strip club to come look at you, okay? To be around the feminine essence, to be around the feminine energy is a privilege, in my opinion, for men. And they do crave that. I mean, they have to obviously pay to come into a place like that just to get female attention, okay? So that alone should tell you right there how much they value it, all right? So if they have to do all that just to be around us, then, you know, you should be very cautious about who you give your time and energy to and to make sure that you are getting paid to do so because men will sit there and take it for free. If you're giving it, they're not going to stop you and say, hey, look, you know, I don't want to, you know, um, waste your time. But some of them will, yes. But majority of the time, if they aren't that into you and you're really not trying to move the conversation along to figure out if you can get them to spend some money on you, then they will just sit there and, you know, take your energy from you and take your time and not compensate you for it. And what will end up happening is you will have sat there for, you know, 20, 30, 40, whatever minutes. And as soon as he sees somebody that he was really waiting for or some girl that just like his dream girl walks by, he's going to be gone. And he he's going to leave you high and dry and probably with no money. So... Uh, this is really important ladies you have to remember the why why you are there okay these guys you know they come in for one purpose you know they don't come in looking for a friend or looking for somebody to you know get to know really you know at the end of the day they're there to see your your stuff all right if we're gonna be like really real about it that's why they're there they're not there for really any other reason. So just remember that, you know, you should only take five to 10 minutes of your time per customer, you know, to see if if they are gonna spend money on you, on you or not. Now, if they aren't spending money within that first, you know, initial time frame, then I always recommend to go back and check in on them because a lot of times guys will change their mind or they're maybe they're just not drunk enough or whatever the excuse of the day is but a lot of times when you go back later on you know you can get something out of them but do not sit there and talk to them for the whole night even if it is slow okay you do not want to do that all right even if you have to go sit by yourself or go back in the dressing room or whatever you got to do just do not do it your presence is so valuable ladies to these men that like I said we have strip clubs for a reason okay men pay money to come be around you for a reason so do not give it away for free because they will take it if you just decide to hand it off to whoever now another reason why I don't recommend that you ladies do this is because the longer you sit there and talk to a customer the more and especially if you're not doing the things that I recommend, like talking about seductive topics, okay, and being like the fantasy girl, if you are talking about boring and mundane things, you are going to get friend zoned very quickly. And it's going to be harder for you and more awkward for, the, for you and him both to, you know, possibly do a dance or something later. The more he gets to know you, the harder it will be for you to get money from him, okay? And you will literally friend zone yourself from getting him to spend money. So 
that is another reason why I don't recommend it. Of course, if this customer is a regular of yours, that's a little bit different, you know, but still, like, if your regular isn't spending money normally, you know, in a certain time frame, I say still go to the next person. You know, a lot of times, too, these guys will come looking for you later on, you know. It's not like you have to go scope them out every time or, you know, worry about checking in with them. A lot of times, you know, they will come up and ask you, you know, um, for something. So, ladies, please, please, please remember this. This is so incredibly important with your time at the club. You do not want to waste it on time wasters, okay? So if you ladies have any further questions, feel free to leave it below and we will see you in the next video.